Welcome to the Dream Pools, a map almost bigger than Queso himself. Which is the first of many with the Eternal Suburbia being the next addition to the Rooster. So if you enjoyed what you are seeing on screen, go wish us the, Steam on, the, the game on Steam and join that Discord for more frequent updates on the game. So let's start with the obvious here being the amazing graphics which are so well made that I could even compare them to AAA games, Handsome Squidward and even Kane Pixel's Backroom series. Now it is pretty obvious that with the plethora of rooms and the skill of the level that a normal dude like me would get lost each 5 seconds. And it is perfect like that because this is the pool rooms, a liminal place where you are on your own. But while in other games being lost would be bad, in this game being lost is normal and rewarding as you encounter different places like the green uncanny place, the children's area, McDonald's, the cozy blue place, and the dark scary place. I'm also pretty sure that if you're lucky enough you can even finish a game without going to any of those places, but that would be only ruining the experience since for me the real goal of the game is to explore those liminal places and to see all the different areas because when I was playing in the game I always wanted to return to the colorful areas and I was always trying to find new, new places. So this place is called a psychological horror game, which is true because I can swear I'm being watched in certain places. I'm looking at you, you colorful balloons in the children's area. I swear that using music and some things slightly moving in the corner of your eye mixed with truly amazing atmosphere can actually gave me chills down my spine. Now, in the game, I felt watched and not stalked, but if you take this quote from the janitor at my school saying, the art of stalking is not to be seen, but to see, which kinda didn't work since he got caught after a while. You would realize that maybe you are stalked by something with better skill than the janitor. All jokes aside, this game nails the horror part uh, with all the drawings and the yellow balls. Finally, each game has its ups and downs, like the popular game Billy the Wizard Rocket Broomstick Ga Racing. And one thing I hate about this game and truly made me cry in bed late at night while listening to music is that you cannot enter slides. What a cruel world. This game can also be a, called a walking simulator 2024, which is fine for, the, for most of the time since being lost in the level is cool and all, but after 80 minutes, I got bored quit and return 3 hours later just to realize that the continue button was not working and I thought that a little sign at the bottom of the screen had something to do with it but I'm either onto something or I'm dumb so please game fix it or make it more obvious how you can like save the progress of, of your game eh, who knows maybe you could even create a side quest to engage the player to explore even more as a final statement, my friend Skinwalker777 really wanted to say something, so here it is. Your mother.